Okay, and our last um, part of section 9.6 is just a couple random formulas. Just like in the last section, I'm going to tell you how to use these things without actually showing you examples, because I don't think having you watch me do arithmetic is a really good use of time as we ramp up to um, the calculus that we're actually going to do in this class. So um, to find the distance between a point um, P and a plane um, given by normal vector n and point q. We're just going to use this distance formula. Distance is going to be the magnitude. Um, actually, you don't even need that sign, I guess. It's going to be the vector qp dotted with the normal vector. Ooh, really crooked line there. Divided Okay, there we go. Divided by the length of the normal vector. And then kind of similar to that is going to be um, if you want to find the distance from a point P. to a line with direction, um, we'll call it V, just to be kind of different, and point Q. We're going to use a pretty similar formula. It's just going to be the uh, magnitude of V cross PQ divided by, that was better, the magnitude of V. So just slightly different, those two things. Um, write these formulas in your notes, and then you'll get to practice the, these formulas in your web work. If you have questions about them, I'm happy to help you. Just it's a matter of you're given all this information. You plug in the numbers and do some arithmetic. So hopefully that's one of the easier things we do 